I've made my way up to the top of Malham Cove here and at the top is this amazing extensive um, limestone pavement. Now as you can see it's a really unusual type of scenery um, which makes it a really visited, uh, well visited area in the Yorkshire Dales. However, why, how do these amazing features form? Well you can see that this particular rock is completely bare of vegetation and the reason why there's so little vegetation on the limestone rock itself is because during the last ice age as the glaciers were moving over this land they scraped it clear of any vegetation that was um, on top of it. Now soil actually takes a very very long time to form so it's not actually been able to regenerate um, yet which is why the limestone rock is completely bare. Now because it's very bare of vegetation it means that it's really susceptible to chemical weathering processes and that's because as it rains um, the, the, um, like the limestone reacts with the rainwater and it causes it to dissolve. Now this eventually is going to start wearing the rock down. Now you can see actually that the limestone is a very distinct feature and it's quite an unusual feature. Carboniferous limestone is not a particularly common rock found within the UK and to have such an extensive amount of it here is quite unusual. Now the rock itself is made up of slabs and these slabs are called clints. Now in between all the clints are cracks and the cracks themselves are called grikes. Now as, the rain, as it rains all of the um, rainwater enters into the cracks in the rock and it causes it to dissolve and these cracks become wider and deeper. Now over time this feature is going to become more and more distinct as the cracks become deeper and deeper. Now inside the cracks, and they can be really quite deep, um, you can find um, some vegetation that can grow in between these cracks and actually they form quite unusual vegetation that can be found here because of the conditions that are found inside the grikes themselves. So you can have all sorts of special vegetation or unique vegetation to this particular area. 